Welcome. In front of me is a Xiaomi 12T Pro and today I'll show you how we can hard reset this device through settings. So to get started, let's open up settings. There we go. And then select about phone. And then below that you will see factory reset. Click on it. This will give you a quick message that you read the factory reset will erase the following items like accounts, contacts, photos, videos, apps, backups, uh, not backups actually, uh, SD card data, also not, and other items on the device. Now, highlight on, on the device. Uh, backups are not on the device. Uh, SD card is not on the device. So if you keep any kind of data on your card, SD card, which not even sure why I'm mentioning it, considering this phone has no SD card tray. So this has basically no validity here whatsoever. Um, but backups and contacts usually are sto stored on Google account. So that is where your contacts, for instance, are. You don't have to worry about it whatsoever. Same goes for photos and videos. If you have cloud backup for your photos through Google uh, and all of them are on the Google account, again, don't worry about it. Now, if you're the type of person that keeps everything locally, not on the cloud, then you might want to create a backup copy of everything that you'd like, like to keep. Otherwise, uh, if you don't create a backup, it will all be removed and there is no way of retrieving that data again. Now, anyway, we can now progress by selecting erase all data. It does give us an option right here to back it up if there is something that you want to do. I believe this backs it up to Google account, or no, never mind, to Xiaomi cloud. So you need to have the Xiaomi uh, account logged in and then you can create a backup to it. Now, additionally, keep in mind when creating a backup to Xiaomi uh, cloud, if you buy another phone later on, for instance, like you buy something like a Samsung and you want to restore this, you won't be able to because this is only restoring, th this will only be restorable to another Xiaomi phone. Same thing like uh, as you would have, for instance, an iPhone and create a backup of your iPhone to iCloud. You won't be able to restore that iPhone backup to another phone that isn't an iPhone. So this is similar kind of idea, just a, a hindrance to make you stick with the brand because uh, a brand loyalty apparently supposed to be forever. So anyway, I'm gonna select factory reset right here. Uh, clear eSIM e data. I don't have an eSIM, so it doesn't really matter what I select here, but if you type of person to use eSIM, you might want to clear it, which I will select it anyway. Now, Xiaomi is also the type of company that considers the, uh, their user base to be an absolute effing morons because it, uh, after giving you that message, it gives you a 10 second blocking message that factory reset erases everything. It's not like that message wasn't already uh, visible before. Uh, and then another 10 seconds that you can't really do anything, uh, letting you know, but are you absolutely certain because this process does remove everything? So once you have your 20 seconds of your life wasted that you will never get back, you can tap on OK and finally begin factory resetting your device. Well done, Xiaomi. It's time to drop that. Just FYI. Now, while this is resetting, uh, I'm going to go just wait to do something else. It's going to take about like two, three minutes to finish up. Once it has, we will be then presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.